The key item of Dalek technology was the casing, derived from the Mark III travel machines built by Davros. The casings of Davros Imperial Daleks were made out of bonded polycarbide. TV. Remembrance of the Daleks. The eye stalk of the casing bestowed superior vision to the Dalek creature. The plunger-shaped attachment functioned as a flexible and adaptable limb. TV. Dalek. Dalek gunsticks could kill almost any sentient being. TV. The Daleks. Al. And could paralyze their victims temporarily or permanently. TV. The survivors. On the Dalek Asylum there was a nanocloud virus that physically transformed organisms into Dalek puppets which removed all emotion except anger and hatred. TV. Asylum of the Daleks. The Daleks gunstick evolved alongside other aspects of Dalek technology. When the first doctor met them in the Dalek city, the gunstick seemed to have the same qualities as a human gun. Daleks could also change the effects of the gun's energy projectiles. At the lowest level, they would merely temporarily disable an individual in the area the projectiles struck. TV. The Daleks. The highest setting on a Dalek gunstick would reduce a human to atoms, but the Daleks rarely used that. Instead, they made certain to dial the guns down to the lowest possible setting that would kill a person. That way, Daleks would ensure that all of their victims died as slowly and painfully as possible. Pros. Prisoner of the Daleks. On the surface of Skaro. Within the confines of the Dalek city, the machines ran on static electricity fed from the city floor. They were incapacitated if removed from the floor. The casing technology changed over the years. The first Daleks to emerge from the bunker in which they had been entombed built a city and power from those. TV. The Daleks. Those occupying Earth during the their 22nd century invasion had dishes on their backs. TV. The Dalek invasion of Earth. Later models of Dalek casing had internal power supplies, and even repulsor systems that allowed them to hover. TV. Remembrance of the Daleks, Dalek, and Fly. TV. The Parting of the Ways, Army of Ghosts, Doomsday, The Stolen Earth, Journey's End. Throughout time and space, there were many Dalek variants that sported different casings. A Dalek's ability depended on what features its casing offered. TV. The Daleks, The Evil of the Daleks. The default manipulator arm could be replaced with the likes of flamethrowers and seismic detectors. TV. The Chase. The Daleks' master plan. By the era of the last Great Time War, Daleks had force fields. Whereas previous versions of Daleks could be destroyed by a well-placed bastic bullet, such bullets could not get close to these Daleks' casings. TV. Dalek. The parting of the ways. However, they could be penetrated by their own weaponry, and variations thereof. TV. Evolution of the Daleks. Victory of the Daleks. They not only could hover, but travel independently through space. TV. The parting of the ways. If an individual touched the casing, they could be burned alive. These Daleks could also use the DNA of a time traveler to regenerate their bodies just by virtue of the traveler touching the casing. TV. Dalek. The Daleks were also experts in biological warfare, and used, or attempted to use, biological weapons on several occasions. TV. The Dalek Invasion of Earth, Planet of the Daleks, Death to the Daleks, Dalek travel technology varied over time. Dalek spaceships were, almost, consistently designed in a saucer shape. TV. Bad Wolf, The Parting of the Ways, The Stolen Earth, Journey's End, Victory of the Daleks, and hoverbouts allowed individual Daleks to travel without using their own power. Audio. Fugitives. The Daleks could apply dimensional transcendentalism to their ships and had their own version of the chameleon circuit. Audio. The apocalypse element. They were also able to hack into virtual reality systems, creating attack ships in pewter space, although they were not particularly good at it. Pros. Love and war. The Daleks also developed time travel capabilities, usually in the form of time corridors which allowed limited transport between one era and another. TV. Resurrection of the Daleks. The Daleks also developed their own kind of time machine of similar capacities to the Doctor's TARDIS. Though they could not change shape, they were also dimensionally transcendental. TV. The Chase. The Daleks' master plan. Members of the Cult of Scaro could initiate emergency temporal shifts which acted as teleports through time and space to let the Dalek escape a threat. TV. Doomsday. Daleks in Manhattan. The Stolen Earth. 